Hello and welcome to Adrian McMaster Gaming. In this video I will show you how to install EUP or custom clothing into your 5M server. So first thing you need to do is go to your resources area of your server. You then create a EUP folder with the brackets either side so that's where all your EUP things will go then that what you do is go to your Google browser go to five mods click on the clothing icon and then look for clothing of your choice now it could be anything in there you might that you would like to use so what I'm going to do I've already downloaded one like a jacket so I want to try and select something else as a little demo so just so I can see what's what so that's a police jacket so I'm going to try that and see what happens you then go to your downloads area and you'll see the folder in there like a raw folder which is like or a zip folder but I have two raw you see the bomber jacket and then you've got a new pad or something I'm not sure what that is yet this is one I've just downloaded, so what you do, I'll open up the bomber jacket first. Now, you need to create a folder in that EUP. It's called bomber jackets. What you do, so you, just so you, so you know what's what, B O B E R underscore jacket. In there, you create a stream folder. S T R E A M. Well, not stream, stream folder. And you want to FX manifest, so you could. Well, not a folder, of course. Text document. Delete all that and type in F X Man E F E S T with a dot L U A almost a dot then you click yes when you get the actual thing flashes up and what you do if you fold it they will vary single player you'll need that uh, open IV which only do that if you know what you're doing so I've got five I'm ready it's in there there are male and there are female so what I'll do if inside of that stream folder you can either open up the folders and put all the YTD folders in one or you can do it this way male or female and then male those will be read now weird of course if there's already folders or like files you have in there with the same name already you will get a conflict so you can use one or the other if you've got old folders and you don't want them anymore with the same name as what that file is you need all those files you need to remove them and put your new ones in if you're happy to do that so just remember that now we're going to try the new pad see what what that is first new pad a turkish paramedic all right hd pictures pad so we have sm it's a brush over the head or hat. It's a similar process. What I'll do, so you've got the hat. So I'll put, drag that out and put a hat. Now that's got to be paramedic SMPGs hat. So I need to put a bracket, at, a square bracket on the side of that to be recognised. Otherwise, I think it's like a stream folder, and then you'll get like an error message. So I want to have a look at what these other folders are first, so I can see they're not the same. A one different folders there. See, the old one, old one. The other one's got a P after that, so double check that. If there's already a P there, you can't use them. So we're going to see what happens. So once the server started up, you'll see on your console that the custom clothing has started up but if 
if there is a spell you now with any of the files like the FX Manifesto resource Lou, you'll get an error like cannot find the meta file or something or cannot start the category up. So just double check that so I can see there in red it started. Minimize that, you'll see on TX admin, bit like a bit better. It's completely started. So what I'm gonna do now is go into the server, so let's go over there. I'm now in the server and I'm in a clothing store, yeah. The character looks a bit like uh well as if it's just come from a circus or something. So what we do, obviously for my server, you've got the fear die, so right click, clothing store, and yeah. then there it is. Uh, snatch your jacket. You can select whichever colour you want. So that's right, the actual the custom jacket in, so that's what how it's all done. I'm not going to come out the server. So remember, you can add more custom clothing, but make sure the names are not the same. So those are the, um, the jackets you saw. So that's all you need to do. If you have liked what you've seen, click like. If you want to see more from me, click subscribe. Don't forget to head over to my website at adriamcmastergaming.com to see more information about me and if you'd like further assistance then please join my discord server with the link provided in the description and as always thanks for watching and goodbye for now and see you all soon Thank you.